Hello everyone, peace be with you and thank you so much for joining me here at the Galaxy with God of Notes. Of course, not everything in this reading will resonate with you. Please use your discernment, take what does and leave the rest. However, if this reading happens to resonate with you, please let me know by commenting down below or liking this message. I want to thank you so much, my new and returning subscribers and all the persons who tune into this channel. Thank you so much for your energies here okay i'm gonna be doing a general reading i don't have much battery on my camera so holy spirit what's the message you have for the collective energy space what do we need to know thank you so collectives you could have been in a situation where you have to make a very difficult decision with two of swords here weighing your options having one foot in one foot out i have also the five of swords in the reverse where you have to make a very hard decision as i said before and so, um, you are someone could want to reconcile some past resentment that you both have because someone is now regretting they are now in remorse but this person at the back of the deck i have the moon so this person could be hiding something or was hiding something from you anything else i have the king of cups here so with the king of cups it could be your energy collective or someone else's in your energy they're coming up as very intuitive. This could be you or them, as I said. Um, very compassionate, very supportive, could be an empath, very balanced and emotional. So I have a King of Cups here. Yeah, so someone created, there was some conflict. I have the Five of Swords in the reverse. So someone want to make peace after a conflict was created. I have also the five of wands so this was some form of competition this person see you as a competition somehow or they are in competition are you well well what i'm getting is this person could have put you in a competition one that you didn't even know of <laughs> anything else with this five of wands with the king of cups have a knight of pentacles in the reverse so this person is coming up as one more card here yeah this person is coming up as not wasn't using their intuition they may have risky investment with the with the tower card here something came to a complete ending some sudden change was made here because someone was not using their intuition they made a decision because they had one foot in one foot out trying to balance their mind as to what do I do or and with a death card at the back of the deck this is telling me something with a tower something came to an end someone made a decision that was not the best decision even though they're coming up as a king of cups they made a decision that was really hard and they made the wrong choice creating a tower and putting a closure to a situation anything else spirit what's the reading anything else we need to know i have a knight of wands so this person could be um very free spirited so this person possibly was a social butterfly they are possibly you know very energetic and move around very fast maybe from flowers to flowers trying to find um the best pollen to pick on I have judgment. So judgment was called in this situation. Someone possibly walked away or someone could be getting, um, could be on their life purpose answering the inner calling. This could be you collective or this could be the person that we're talking about who was really um, very sneaky and creating a conflict or a competition in your energy. I have the four of wands in the reverse. So someone wants to come back home someone left home or left a place they considered to be home but they want to come back home i have the four of wands in the reverse they are now feeling unstable and they're feeling as if you won't be welcoming them back 
into your life or your energy or back home. Yeah, I have the two of pentacles at the back. So someone was multitasking and in doing so, they have chosen the wrong choice. And this choice they create that they chose or chosen create a store in their life and create a death of a situation. Man. Thank you. I have the magician in the reverse. The magician in the reverse is someone who's considered to be very manipulative. Very scattered energy. The energy was scattered. So as a result they feel as if everything that glitters is gold because their energy was not balanced they had they didn't have balanced energy so they were out of touch with their emotion and their sense of choices so they made a choice that was not useful to them at the back of the deck i have the star um could be dealing with an aquarius Anything else, right? Yeah, I have a ten of swords. So someone is removing ten swords out of their back, little by little, because they have now learned a lesson, a painful lesson that that they're now healing from. So this could be you collective learning from the past and moving on from a king of cups who was not able to make the right choice in love or friendship. So you're now moving on and being even stronger being even stronger than you were before you have survived this pain and now you have something you're healing and able to teach others the pain that you've been through anything else to close this reading <laughs> yeah i have the wheel of fortune so now that you have closed out this cycle or this painful ending you are now considered to be your karma is good. You're at a turning point where the universe is in control of whatever you're doing or control of your life. So your karma is good and you should be expecting some great results from whatever you're working on. Anything else? Yeah, so now you, your karma is good. Collective, I have the, th the three of cups and it's telling me now that you're now able are even willing to work with others towards a particular goal. You could be collaborating with other people, even going out, or if you're not, you should be going out and having fun. I have also the Five of Cups. So someone could be regretting their, their actions, disappointed in their ways, and feeling sad, mourning the loss of a Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, so they are feeling and they're grieving the loss of this queen of pentacles because of your choices. They made poor choices and they get poor, poor reward. Anything, go, any advice going forward on the spirit? Any advice going forward? Anything we need to work on? Anything we need to know? Yeah, I have illusion. I'll take one more. One more card, please. One more card. I got too much. I got too much. I won't take any. I have illusion. It says, avoid the trap of mistaking a fantasy for a true soul connection. And I have surprise. You may be, you may be about to be surprised. Yeah. So as I said um going forward whatever you're working on collectives this could be a surprise to you that you are your luck is so good so this as i said you should be expecting unexpected unexpected great result from whatever you're working on with the wheel of fortune here because good luck good luck is on your side why am i tongue-tied <laughs> yeah so someone um this card says Avoid the trap of mistaking a fantasy for a true soul connection. So this person could be, uh, what should I say? It? This person could live in a life of illusion, believing 
that everything that glitters, as I said before, is gold. But that was just an illusion that they painted in their mind going forward.